Okay, so I didn't go today to to change my lease. I got so fucking scared last night. It was weird. Um, I had first of all, I don't know for how long I, I've been waking up. I would think two or three hours after I fall asleep after a short dream, and I'm never really quite sure that I'm awake because it's dark and everything. And I fall back asleep. Last night I dreamt. Uh, the first dream was very strange. I was with a group of people in uh, like a forest or something. And we were trying to get the attention of some other people a long ways away. It was like we were a group of natives banging on drums. And I was in a tree and I sort of ripped a branch or part of the tree and I was able to swing myself and then swing myself all the way around. And it was just fantastic, you know. It was like a, like a really amazing swing. And um, then I woke up. And I was lying there and I was thinking, am I awake or am I asleep? And then I went back to sleep and I had a terrible dream about being in a house and Anne Sophie and uh, some guy came there and another girl and I was really angry and I was going to beat the guy up and I started smashing things and ripping things and peeing on things and told them to get the fuck out and never come back and that it was just the same as the last time and oh my god and I, it, it was a terrible dream and I woke up then really really nervous and I haven't stopped being nervous I mean my heart is actually beating extra time at the moment so I don't think I'm going to do it today um, because I'm too scared to do it I need to settle down a bit I've obviously taken a big mental step forward, but, uh, you know, it's also kind of costing me, and I'm so scared right now, I could, I don't know what I could do, but I could do something that scared people do. Uh, yeah, I mean, my stomach is sore, and, and I'm shaking almost, so uh, I'm putting it off for at least a day. And I'm thinking maybe I'll go and do it by the post instead of face to face. But I, I know I'm doing it, you know. Because as much as I, I think about it and I'm scared and I'm thinking, oh God, where am I going to end up and all that, the truth is that staying here is just... Okay, it's a bit safer. But it's terrible. It's insane. Again, you know, here's an example. I had a student on, who's Bernard, who's really nice, on Tuesday night. It is now Thursday afternoon. My next bit of human contact will be Monday night with another student. So I'll go, you know, effectively six and a half days without human contact. And then I'll do that again and again and again. <laughs> It's just got to stop. Plus, I've found two or three people on the internet who seem to be willing to take me. So I've got to just get over this nervousness. And frankly, I just don't want to do it today because I don't want to face, face, face them today. Well, that's the excuse I'm using. But anyway, I didn't do it today. I got scared. I got really, really, really scared. <laughs> so I'm going to try again real soon, like tomorrow.